हेलो स्टूडेंट्स हम आपके लिए अच्छे से अच्छे वीडियोस ला रहे हैं अगर आप हेडफोन लगा के हमारे वीडियोस आखिर तक देखते हो और बार बार देखते हो तो आपकी अच्छी लर्निंग होगी और आपके अच्छे स्कोर्स यानी के मार्क्स आएंगे आप टॉपर स्टूडेंट बन जाओगे क्योंकि प्रैक्टिस मेक्स मैन परफेक्ट हम आपके लिए मेहनत से वीडियो बनाते हैं सिर्फ हमारे लिए एक काम करो हमारे वीडियोज को लाइक करो चैनल सब्सक्राइब करो और सबसे महत्वपूर्ण बात बेल आइकॉन प्रेस करना ना भूलो ताकि जब भी हम नया वीडियो बनाएंगे या कोई नया अपडेट आपके लिए होगा तो तुरंत आपको मिल जाएगा हमारे वीडियोस को शेयर करना ना भूलो आपकी पढ़ाई के लिए हमने एक खास ऐप बनाया है इसमें आपके लिए होंगे क्वेश्चन आंसर्स क्वेश्चन पेपर्स भी आपको मिलेंगे इसमें और इसमें सबसे अच्छी बात जो कि एम सी क्यू टाइप क्वेश्चन यानी कि क्विज टाइप क्वेश्चन होंगे आप वहाँ पे टेस्ट दे सकते हैं और आपके तुरंत मार्क्स आपको मिलेंगे आपका परफॉर्मेंस आप खुद चेक कर सकते हैं ये ऐप आप आपको गूगल प्ले स्टोर पर मिलेगा सिर्फ आपको सर्च करना है माई बेस्ट गुरु नाम से थैंक यू एंड बेस्ट लक फॉर योर स्टडी एक्स्ट्रा क्वेश्चंस डियर स्टूडेंट्स नाउ लर्न द एक्स्ट्रा क्वेश्चंस ऑफ लेसन नंबर एट हाउ सीजन्स ऑकर पार्ट टू कैन यू टेल डिस्कस द एक्टिविटी यू हैव बीन कैरिंग आउट सिंस जून मेक यूज ऑफ द ऑब्जर्वेशन टेबल्स for the month of june september and december one in which month the duration of the day was around 12 hours answer in the month of september the duration of the day was around 12 hours two what could be the reason behind it answer in this month the sun was at the center of the east horizon means there was no dakshinayan or uttarayan therefore the whole day is divided in equal parts of the day time and night time therefore the duration of the day was around 12 hours and night was also of 12 hours 3 on these days the sun is on the plane of the equator bring out the differences between the duration of day time in the month of june september and december answer due to the axial tilt of the earth in june the day time is the longest in september day time and the night time are around equal while in december day time is found shortest think about it one in which direction will the location of sunrise and sunset appear to move after 22nd of december answer the location of sunrise and sunset will move towards the north direction after 22nd of december two what effects do the seasons have on the biodiversity in india write briefly about it answer there is a big impact on the biodiversity due to the seasons seasonal variation like heavy rainfall and late arriving of monsoon this effect food related chain reaction amongst the population of india seasonal biotic interference can be beneficial or may be harmful to the plant life common man and farmers suffer lot due to lack of production observe figure carefully and answer one how is the northern hemisphere in which you live positioned relative to the sun on the dates given in figure answer northern hemisphere we are closer to the sun in winter than we are in summer but the seasonal changes are not due to the distance to the sun they are due to the tilt of our axis and how the sun rays strike the planet in a 
more direct or a less direct manner. Two, which season will you experience in the which shows the position of the earth in relation to the sun? You can guess which season prevails in which hemisphere. Answer. One, the seasons are due to the tilt of the earth's axis, due to which when one hemisphere will get more direct sun rays, other hemisphere will get inclined rays. Two, therefore the hemisphere which has direct rays will experience summer and which has inclined rays will suffer winter. Three, which season will you experience in the northern hemisphere around 22nd December? Answer, we will experience the winter season in the northern hemisphere around 22nd December. Four, what would be the season in the northern hemisphere around 21st June? Answer, it would be summer season in the northern hemisphere around 21st June. 5. If it is winter in the northern hemisphere, which season will it be in the opposite hemisphere? Answer. It would be summer at the opposite side of the hemisphere. 6. At any given point of time, why are the seasons in the northern and southern hemisphere different? Answer. When one part of the planet is more directly exposed to the sun rays, which experiences summer, while the other hemisphere is exposed with inclined sun rays, experiences winter. Therefore, northern and southern hemispheres always experience opposite seasons. Use your brain power. 1. On equinox days, the two poles experience either sunrise or sunset. On which pole will it be sunrise on 21st March? Answer. The sunrise will be on north pole because from that day the sun is tending towards the north as Uttarayan starts. 2. While India and England are located in the same hemisphere, why are the cricket matches in these two countries arranged in different months? Answer. Though India and England are located in northern hemisphere, months of rainy days vary in both countries. It is not the hemispheres, but the geographical structure is responsible for the rainfall schedule. Therefore, cricket matches in these two countries are arranged in different months. 3. On 21st March and 23rd September, daytime and nighttime are same all over the earth. But why do some parts experience summer and some parts winter on these days? Answer. Some parts which are away from the equator due to inclined rays that take more time to change in season. For these parts, season cannot be changed in a day as it takes more time to decrease or increase the temperature. Therefore, some parts experience summer and some parts winter on 21st March and 23rd September. 4. Mention any two countries in the world where one needs woolen clothing in the month of May. Also mention their latitudinal positions. Answer. Oymyakon and Verkhoyansk in Russia, Denali in USA, Eureka in Canada, etc. require woolen clothes in these countries in the month of May. 5. The summer capital of Jammu and Kashmir is Srinagar and the winter capital is Jammu. What could be the reason? Answer. Srinagar is suitable place to control all political 
territorial and functional working as it is located nearly in the middle of the populated area of Jammu and Kashmir therefore the summer capital of Jammu and Kashmir is Srinagar and the winter capital is Jammu मित्रों आम्मी आप चांगले चांगले वीडियोज बनवत आहोत जर तुम्हें आमच चैनल सब्सक्राइब कराल आम् वीडियोज इतरान शेयर कराल वीडियोज वर लाइक व कमेंट कराल तो आम्मी तुम्हारा जास्तीत जास्त वीडियोज घेन यू आम्चा मैबेज गुरु चैनल सब्सक्राइब बटन व क्लिक करूँ सब्सक्राइब करा